Hi, my name is Amy Larson and I am the advanced ceramics teacher here at Wellesley High School. I'm first gonna show you some of the work you can expect your student to be bringing home. Then I will tell you a little bit about myself and my own background and I'll take you on a tour of the classroom. So this year for our class, we are starting out, I had them start out just by throwing, right? I didn't give them too many directions. I just wanted them to get you know, their hands dirty again. And then they're having the opportunity to turn these tumblers into candles. So they haven't all done it yet, but anybody who wants to will have the opportunity to make a candle. And then after that, they got into a set of two cups with handles. And I have these really cool decals. So you can see I've got one that's like a, a metallic bumblebee on there and I've got these feathers, but we went through some different surface qualities and textures that they can do with their glazes and their underglazes. And currently they are working on bottles. Um, they're working on pitchers with spouts and handles. So this is just a pitcher or an oil dispenser, right? So we're going to turn the idea of spouts and handles into something that becomes more like a bottle. Um, and then I will get into some larger bowls, like for pasta bowls. So my goal with advanced ceramics is all things functional. Everything that comes home is non-toxic, food safe. It can go in your oven, it can go in your microwave, um, and it's definitely dishwasher safe, as long as there's no cracks in the piece. And then we're gonna get into some plates. Uh, plates are tricky uh, because you don't want it to just be a pancake, and sometimes that happens. So. Um, all of the students are doing a really great job. My goal is to coach them to um, really reach their own creative potential. Uh, and they, they all come in at different points and especially with the past and COVID, um, everybody is coming at this from a different perspective. So my goal is just to help them to find their own potential uh, creatively. So a little bit about myself. I'm from upstate New York. I'm from Rochester and I went to Rochester Institute of Technology, RIT. My undergrad is in pre-medical studies and painting. And then I went on to get my master's in art education. And I started out teaching at the middle school here in Wellesley. I taught sixth and seventh grade art and eighth grade photography. And I've been at the high school for 15 years. Um, running the ceramics program, and this is my 20th year teaching. So uh, my entire career has been here in Wellesley. So a little about the studio. Um, I'm sorry you're not all here in person, but we've got a really nice space. I've got some skylights. And the way I throw, so this is my station right here. And thanks to WEF, I have this great mirror over the top of me so it can um, show what's happening inside my hands so then the students can see what I'm doing. And then simultaneously, I project myself um, on the smart board so then everybody can see what's happening. And then this is where the students all throw. And I have quite a few tables for hand manipulating the pieces, adding handles or doing any kind of you know, extra to their work. I also teach a sculpture class. And back here, we recycle all of our clay. So anytime students make something and they don't keep it, they put it down into this bucket right here. And then I take it out of that bucket and I can put it through this big machine, this pug mill, and it can spit out more clay that we can utilize. And in here, this is my kiln room. So students are in and out of this space all the time. It's a great place to be creative. And I do have some open studio blocks in the morning and scattered throughout the cycle. So if your students are looking for more time to be in the ceramics room, uh, please have them check out the schedule. I'd be happy to host them as long as I have the space. So sorry I'm not meeting you in person, but thanks for watching.